Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 13. I'm JB, and uh, I've gone back to trying the Rock Band mic because I think it was just my computer that was making it sound weird. So let's see what happens. Um, a little backstory to today. I believe that I'm about to fight one of the most annoying bosses in this game, for the early stages at least. Uh, so, <clears throat> in preparation for that, I decided to play the world's hardest game on AddictingGames.com. And, uh, let's just say that wasn't the best idea, because now I'm a little annoyed. I only got a third of the way through the game, and I just gave up. It's slightly difficult. Yeah, we'll go with difficult. Um, so, since I'm going to, uh, play one of the harder bosses of this game, Maybe this update, maybe next one. I figured it would be a good time to get myself all annoyed, so if my temper's a little shorter than normal, I was almost on purpose. Any trace of the Lassie? Nothing. No sign it's been activated. Huh? Who's there? Alright. Let's kill these guys. Um. Huh. On top of that, I've spent the last week only doing editing. I haven't played basically a thing since the last date I gave you. Um, so now I'm only two weeks ahead instead of three weeks. Which means, well, let's just hope I uh, get enough quality recording in. Uh, the other thing is, if I die a lot, um, I'm not really sure what to do about that. So, what was I uh, was cutscene. Here? Probably thought we'd try and use a pulse machine to escape. Maybe we should try it. What does this do? Hey, you're gonna hurt yourself. Don't touch that. Wait, what if it works? Leave it. I told didn't tell you, you to leave it. <laughs> Stop! Stop already! I think I got it. Light! I think I can work this! I don't think lightning's impressed. <sighs> Alright, uh... I was very confused when I saw this at first. It's... Not exactly, uh... Anyways. This is, this is a mini-game, and I just screwed the camera up. Alright, let's go. Uh, this is a mini-game that, it doesn't really tell you it's a mini-game, but the object is to kill as many people as possible using mostly just your sweeps. And you've only got three sweeps. Oops. There we go. And uh, you can run them over. You can uh, you can sweep them. So basically, you want to kill 40 or more of these armament armament soldiers, whatever, with your sweeps. And strike. The only reward you get from this is better spoils from a couple of treasure chests. So let's see how I do. Crap. That wasn't so great. Let's see. Hitting. And one more. Yeah, that was crap. So, obviously, kill them all anyways. Glad you died. Bye. Oh, I don't have another one. Rats. I forgot about these guys. Oh well, so I didn't do so well. I don't really care. Nice landing. 
Let's get moving. Just need a minute. I'm still a bit <laughs> winded. You're too soft. Uh, wait up! And this is what our reward is. These two treasure chests. I got... 300 gil. I think I got, like, silver, basically. And, uh... Spark ring. Alright, so... What I'm going to do is... Hmm, I'm gonna give him a... Well, not yet. Never mind. I'm gonna screw around for a bit first. So, uh... Yeah, as I was about to say, um, <laughs> I don't, we, uh, we being myself, went and did a little bit of editing, and, uh, I gotta say, I'm getting a little bit better at editing, which is great, because I like editing, but, uh, I would like to get a little better at commentating, because this is kind of the reason I'm doing this, is commentary, partially for myself, mostly for you guys. Um, and although I, I don't do this for subscribers, it would be nice to get a couple of subscribers to, you know, see who's watching it, have a few comments and feedback, it would be pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I'm probably going to do this even if I don't get a single new subscriber, or at least to the end of this game. Uh, but it would be nice to heal myself. Stay sharp. Here! I need to keep an eye on these things, don't I? Heal myself. Alright. Just stay out of my way. You guys are supposed to warn me when I'm getting low on health. How can you not warn me? Gee. Yeah. Uh this is a completely different game from that other one, I'll tell you that much. Slightly uh not as annoying. Let's go this way. Oh. I don't know if I actually went this way before. Let's see if I can get a. No, I can't get preemptive on new ones. And let's get rid of this tracker first. He should go down pretty easy and. Um, yeah. Wait, who who is he shooting? That's supposed to be a guided missile and he missed. Oh, I get it. He's trying to blow something up. Um I'll just stay away from that. Hopefully. Alright. That, that thing right there, basically, uh, I think what it is is it, it she, he shot that near lightning where she was, and uh, the guided missiles would basically keep hitting her, so you would want to destroy that, and uh, it would kind of save you a little bit. Um, don't really need my Ravager. Really need a medic either, I guess, but hey. So I just ignored it because it wasn't going to uh, hit me. There we go. Spark ring. Spark ring. Um, like the name sounds, it protects you against lightning. We may have already seen that. Do I already have one of those? Um. Or. I have three of those right now. Alright, so I'm just gonna level up my Crystarium a little bit. And, uh... No! I want this! This is the thing I was telling you about earlier. I really like this ability. You will probably see why as soon as I first get to use it. It is possibly the best ability in this game. Well... Aside from their uh, special abilities, but we'll get into that later. Am I going the right way? Well, I guess. 
I get a preemptive on them? They are just not very vigilant. Vigilance is key. Alright. Uh, I want a blitz. Give me blitz. Come on. Oh well. Ah. Uh, yeah, short work with these guys. Doesn't really matter. Um, so yeah, I was saying stuff about how it was editing. I, uh, I'm trying to get better at the commentary because right now I'm not as good as some people I've seen. Um, and I would like to get more subscribers. And as I said, I don't do this for the subscribers, but it's nice to get a few. Um, yeah, so basically, you can completely bypass all of them here, but I'm not going to. I'm going to fight. There's the one. Alright, get rid of these trackers first. And... Good, as long as I stay away from that point, I'll be great. Or in peace. Just stay out of my way. Go heal yourself. Stay away. Come on, lightning. As I said, lightning is not or you can't move these characters while you're battling, which is really annoying. Um, possibly the most annoying part of this game. I guess we can't target that grapple point, but uh I guess we don't need to anyways. Slash and burn. Burn and slash. Ooh, that Not too Stay much. Sharp. At that point, that thrust is a little higher. And... Here. Take him down. Slash and burn. Good. Those Ulans, I'm not a big fan of that kind of uh, enemy. But um, I'll live with it, I guess. I didn't miss anything? No, didn't think so. Anyways, on to the next save point. Alright, this is a good spot to split the video because something big is coming up. I will do some upgrading first, though, maybe. What have I got? Doctor's Code. Oh, um, that's too much. Just gonna be selling those guys, so I'll do that. And, alright. This is something uh, very interesting. You take a Doctor's Code, you upgrade it to, to its star level, which is only 200 experience points, and then you dismantle it. And you get Fortisol, Aegisol, Ethersol, and the most important part, an elixir. Uh, the elixir completely refills your, I believe, your TP gauge. And uh, very important to have. Let's see if I can uh, upgrade my Crystarium just a little further. Launch ability isn't going to do much for me. But, Hope was getting upgraded in magic. Uh, 130, 130. Alright, so... It's not going to be an awful lot, but enough to help. And... I'm going to set equipment. Uh, spark ring. And... Spark ring. You shall see why shortly. Save, and I'll see you guys in a few minutes.